Hey y'all, it's Megan from Made for Mermaids again, and today I'm going to show you how to sew the hammock add-on for the gables. This is a free pattern piece, you just get it on the website. It comes in the youth size and then also the adult size. So on your pattern piece, you're gonna see two cut lines. One cut line right here on top is for a rolled hem or no hem allowance, and the bottom one is for if you want to hem the hammock piece. So either way, if you want to do a rolled hem or add fold over elastic here, then you would just fold and cut it there. Or if you want to do a half inch hem, then you would cut it here. So you cut the same pieces as the tutorial and then two mirror images of your hammock piece at either cut line. If you want to do the rolled hem, you'd quickly just do it with your serger. I just did a regular serged edge real quick because I didn't want to change it for the rolled hem, but the rolled hem would probably be a little bit more comfortable um, for whoever's wearing them. So if you wanna do that, it would just look like this. You can also finish the straight edge with fold over elastic, or you can hem, if you cut it at the longer cut edge, you could just press half an inch toward the wrong side and hem that piece. So this is really simple to add just move these out of the way. It doesn't matter which um, you choose, the hemmed or the rolled hem, it's gonna be the same. So you're gonna have your main piece here, and this is your center front. You can also use the fly option with this. It works for either way. So you're just gonna pin the center, just like normal, just like the tutorial. Okay, so you have it just like that. Now, before you stitch this, you're gonna flip it over so the wrong side is up, and you're going to take wrong side, you're going to take your hammock piece, and you're gonna put the right side of the hammock to the wrong side of the boxers and you're going to pin this curve the same. So now you have all three pieces together. You have the center, front, right sides together with the main piece and then the hammock right sides to the wrong piece. So there's the hammock piece and there's the center piece, and now you're going to stitch this with a half inch seam allowance. Okay, so I stitched this seam, and all you're gonna do is pull the center and the hammock towards the center, like that, and you can see that that seam is all enclosed And there's the hammock piece. Now you just do the same thing on the other side. So here's the main piece. Here's my other hammock piece. I'm actually gonna show you, you can pin either one first. So here's the main wrong side of the main piece. I'm gonna quickly pin the hammock on. We're gonna flip it over and we're gonna get that center piece again. Make sure this doesn't twist. I keep saying that in every video. It's easier on the smaller one, but the, on the adult sizing, sometimes it can get twisted. So you can kind of move that hammock piece out of the way. And then we're gonna pin the center. I 
Again, now you have three layers, the hammock piece, the main boxers, and then the center front. Okay, looks like that, and like this from this side. Now we're going to again stitch with a half inch seam allowance. Okay, so we stitched that in here. This is what it will look like when you're complete. And now all you're going to do is put them together at the top like this and you're gonna baste all the way across at about a quarter inch based here and then you're going to do the same thing along the bottom put the hammock piece together and then baste here and here so you still have the opening at a quarter inch and then you finish sewing the inseam the waistband and the hemline all in the same way I'm going to link the videos of how to finish the gables below but that is it. I hope that you guys love the hammock hack. I know um, it's one of our favorite hacks that we have on the blog. It's so quick and it looks really nice. It finishes all the edges on the inside. And I know a lot of people like to wear them. If you do make them, please share. We love to see it. Share in our Facebook group and tag us on Instagram. We can't wait to see. Thank you so much. Bye.